In this video we're going to look at how to create a groove joint. I've already selected my top panel and over here we're in the link section of the properties menu and we've got the left side open. So we're looking at the link between the top and the left side here. Now you can only create a groove joint when the priority is set to underpassing so let's change that now. With underpassing selected we can now change the type to groove. I'm going to add a groove of 10 millimeters. Zoom right in. So now the left side has been rebated by 10 millimeters. It's not really a groove, it just means that the top will now penetrate into the side by that distance. If the top is moved down, it would become a groove. Like this, it's just a rebate. To make it into a groove, let's select the side panel, which is set to overpassing in this link here with the top and I'm going to apply an overlap of 30 millimeters. So there you've got a classic groove joint. I'm going to undo that now so I can show you one extra application of this and that's to make the groove deeper than the thickness of the underpassing panel. So I'm going to go back to the top panel, left side link and make the groove this time 40 mil. So this has extended the overpassing panel beyond the other panel and in fact it's extended it outside the total cabinet dimensions which can be useful for other design applications. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.